Brother Neil here, and today we're tasting M&M's eggs, new for the Easter season. Well, it's not even Valentine's yet, and and already M&M's have released their Easter product. It looks like a candy-coated egg-shaped M&M with a peanut butter filling. Never seen these before in Canada. I'm not sure if they're out in other parts of the country or in the U.S. But let's give them a shot. Are they trying to compete with the Cadbury milk eggs? Those yummy, crunchy, chocolate milky deliciousness that comes out every Easter? Well, we'll try the M&M's peanut butter take on the Easter egg. 210 calories right on the front of the package there. Let's give you the nutritional fact highlights on the rear. 13 grams of fat. Seven of those are saturated fat. Zero grams of trans fat. 17 grams of sugar. And 75 milligrams or 3% sodium. It's February 2018. And we're going to take a bite of this M&M wig peanut butter M&M eggs. We'll open the package, do a quick sniff test, and then tell you how tasty and crunchy they are. Would you look at those beautiful looking M&M candies. And don't we have the perfect lighting today for this? A nice sunny, wintry day? Easter Sunday falls on April 1st this year. And it's February, and we're trying M&M's peanut butter Easter eggs. Let's do a quick sniff test. Well, M&M's don't really have much of a smell because of this candy coating. So here we go. M&M's peanut butter eggs going in. Crunchy candy coating, the uh, peanut butter and chocolate filling. If I didn't know better, I would say E.T. was in my back seat and we were tasting Reese's Pieces. They're really close to a Reese's Pieces type candy, just a little bit bigger in size so you get more chocolate and peanut butter. Giving these a Brother Neil thumbs up though. Thanks for joining us on this edition of Junk Food Junction Reviews. Don't forget to click on our Instagram page. It's right down there in the link below. And we hope you join us on the next edition of Junk Food Junction Reviews. Have a happy Easter. I'm sure we'll talk before then. Brother Neil, out.